What's up with everybody? It's your boy Buki Jones for Rated R Sports Debates, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls across the world. All right before we get into the episode, make sure to subscribe, hit the like button. We got a great episode for y'all today. Um, don't forget to subscribe to our playback. We be live there watching the games with us live. Go ahead and get the VIP pass if you want to watch with us for free. To enjoy the commentary and the entertaining by watching us. Uh, the playback link will be in the description and will be in the chat as well. Um, last night, man, LeBron James disappointed the whole Laker fan base. Um, he disappointed um, the whole NBA world, right? Um, when he didn't go to Kobe Bean Bryant's memorial um, statue uh, reveal, uh, you had the likes of the Laker fans was there um, outside supporting it. You got the Laker teammates that was there. You had Darvin Ham, Phil Handy, Austin Reeves. I mean, you had Kareem there. Magic was there as well. Adam Silver, um, Jeannie Buss. Everybody was there just to celebrate a special moment for Kobe B. Bryant. Um, one of the greatest Lakers of all time. You can make an argument that he is the greatest Laker of all time. And the fact that LeBron James didn't show up was very, very disappointing. Right? And... Um, I got to call the media out, right? Outside of a couple of people on YouTube who called this stuff out, called this BS out, man. Um, y'all know who they are, right? Um, the media who has bigger following, they own national TV, right? Um, ESPN, one of the most popular sports channels in the world. Um, you know, ESPN fs1 you name it the mainstream media right didn't call out lebron james for not being at kobe b bryant statue celebration day right and i quite find it funny because when people sit there and say that lebron james is the most hated player in the media or the most hated player in the nba no he's the most protected player in the nba because i don't understand how this man lebron james can literally just get away with BS at the BS and the media barely calls this man out, right? This is LeBron James third or fourth time where he's done it. He did it with D-Wade when he didn't show the D-Wade retirement speech. He did it with um, Kobe Bean Bryant funeral memorial service where he didn't show up to Kobe Bean Bryant's uh, funeral memorial service, right? And then he did it yesterday where he didn't show up to Kobe's statue reveal, right? And I just always thought that LeBron James has been always been jealous of Kobe Bean Bryant. He's been jealous with Kobe um, when Kobe saved Team USA. I think LeBron James had some jealousy on that. Um, uh, Kobe has shown nothing but respect for LeBron James. Um, when you look at Kobe Bryant last tweet, his tweet in his post was just giving thanks to LeBron James. And the fact that LeBron James came to be to a statue reveal ceremony. And give respect to Kobe when he's supposed to be the face of the NBA. When he's supposed to be the face of the Los Angeles Lakers team. Shows that LeBron James don't have no honor. No respect. And he just all just nothing but disrespectful, bro. And then I'm just very, very disappointed that, you know, the reporters didn't ask them why they didn't see LeBron James at Kobe Bean Bryant's, um, you know, statue reveal ceremony, right? And I just don't have no respect for dude, right? I don't have a respect for LeBron James. Um, he's jealous. He's mad that people um, have Kobe over him. Uh, LeBron James is jealous that he is not respected as Kobe as he lost in those Lakers. And it's it just sad. And the fact that the media has it came out there and spoke on this situation is disgusting. It's just pure disgusting. But you got a couple of people on YouTube, like myself, is calling out the BS and the nonsense. The lack of media coverage on this is just crazy to me. Now, when people sit there and say, oh, Mookie, why, why are you should care of LeBron there? Why, why is it a big deal? It's a big deal because he's the face of the NBA. It's a big deal that he's the representation of the Los Angeles Lakers today. It's a big deal that he's the face of the Lakers. So that's why it's a big deal because 
you had all the Laker great there. People try to deflect, and LeBron James try to LeBron James fanboy try to deflect why Shaq was there. Well, Shaq was in Atlanta doing TNT, and Shaq had the opportunity to go. Shaq would be there, but the obligation as well was understandable. It wasn't understandable that LeBron James wasn't there because the game was like three or four hours. I mean, they had a ceremony three or four hours before their game against the Denver Nuggets. And the fact that LeBron James didn't even show up, he shouldn't even, couldn't even give respect. It, it just disgusts me, bro. It disgusts me. But yet when the media want to sit there and deflect it to other players and when other players do the same thing, the media bash. Them. Man, I don't understand why. Right. So at the end of the day, I think it's disgusting. I think it's unacceptable. And I think LeBron James is just, Laker fans just don't respect LeBron. They just don't because this is who he is. He's the shysty guy, right? And then not only you didn't show up the Kobe B. Bryant <laughs> statue reveal, but you choked in the fourth quarter when Vanessa Bryant was there, her daughters were there, Natalia and the other little daughter that was there. Kobe and Bryant was there on Kobe's day. You choked in the fourth quarter, missed six straight shots under the rim near the basket as well. This man LeBron is just a complete fraud, man. Like I don't understand why y'all respect this dude. This man missed six straight shots in the fourth quarter and couldn't even win a game on Kobe did when it was a winnable game. But LeBron fans sit there and deflect to other people. Sit there and deflect to other... I just don't understand. But the, ma the lack of media coverage and people not calling this out is sad. And LeBron James didn't even speak out on you know, the situation on why he didn't attend. He didn't even attend his best friend's retirement speech. How class is this dude? This is sad, man. Um, I don't. I lost all respect for LeBron. LeBron been not like Kobe, and. I just want to give a shout out to Kobe, the greatest Laker of all time. Um, shout out to everybody that attended. I was, I even was told that Laker players was there. Some Clipper players was there as well. Um, but LeBron James wasn't there. Make that make sense, Jack? There was no report that he was there. And when people sit there and say, maybe he didn't want to be around a lot of cameras. Maybe we talking about LeBron James. We're talking about a guy, as soon as he stepped out of his house, there's photos and pictures there. So you're telling me that LeBron James can dodge so many cameras, so many pictures, all of that, right? You tell me they didn't get one photo of him? And then when Phil Jackson, when you watch the ceremony, right? Because they was cutting to different players, right? When Phil Jackson asked guys to stand up who were who, players who have won a championship with the Los Angeles Lakers, they cut the camera to everybody that stood up. LeBron James didn't stood up. He wasn't there. This how sorry and low hanging fruit he is, bro. He, he's he's terrible, man. And I can't wait to the Lakers move on for this guy. Let me know what you think in the comment section. It's your boy Mookie Jones. I'm out.